Elsewhere, lawyers, leaders of civil society organizations and professionals across all sectors of the economy have called on Kogi state indigents at home and in diaspora to help security agencies make the state on inhabitable for criminals masquerading as politicians in the state, especially as the November 11 governorship election draws near. They called on the people of Kogi State to resist those they describe as criminal political merchants trying to blackmail security agencies in the interest of their unpopular ambitions. Representatives of more than 50 CSOs and scores of lawyers under the broad platform of lawyers and activists for good governance made the position known at a press conference conference in Abuja. Barrister Mohamed Abdurazak Sani, a lawyer from Igalamela, local government area Kogi State, and Cole Convener, lawyers and activists for good governance who address the press on behalf of others, one that some mischievous political figures in the state were working towards bringing back the dark days of instability by supporting criminal elements to cause chaos. These persons of disharmony, specializing in playing one ethnic group in Kogi State against the others, in their wicked and evil agenda to make sure that crisis erupts in the state, which they reckon could work in their favor to clinch political offices, especially as the state governorship election is approaching. They have been engaging in criminal propaganda on social media and regular media to create mass disaffection against the incumbent government in the state. An average co guide who understands the state terrain very well will testify that who testified at Kogi State in the last seven years, plus has witnessed the uprooting of violent criminals like kidnappers, terrorists, armed robbers, and others from the state since the inception of the current administration in the state. But there are mischievous political figures in the state who wish to bring back these dark days of instability by supporting criminal elements to cause chaos in the state and thereafter quickly rush to the public to paint accusing fingers at security agencies or the state government. This is a failed bid to cover their poorly disguised criminal tracks, especially when security agencies go after their criminal prestige. These are the same political goons who move around the state to erect structures of ethnic acrimony and suspicion for political advantage. They don't mean well for the state, and co-guides are enjoined to resist anyone or group desperately trying to find the embers of disunity and mutual acrimony in the state. They are atrocious characters with wicked and evil agenda to benefit from the crisis they are provoking. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.